This morning is the uh, fourth day of our Forensic Science Camp, and today the students are learning about uh, biological evidence and about footwear impression evidence. This is one day of a five-day camp where students are exposed to two new forensic science disciplines each day. So with these chemicals, we were uh, finding which stains on this t-shirt to blow. So for example, this stain here is blood, but some of the ones on the are not. Alright, so now we can put it onto our shirt here, and we can look at all of our different stains. So you thought this one was blood, so what color did that turn? Black. Black, so you guys were pretty good with that one. They're from all over the state, all over West Virginia and all over the United States. We have people coming here from, afar, um, from as far away as Colorado. Um, my name is Laurel, and I was looking at the blood stain on the front of the yeah. paw shirt. It looks like there's a few bullet holes there with blood that might have came out. And there's also a few other stains that we're not sure where they are yet. It's, 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 it's not a super dark brown, but there's still some like... Like there's like light parts and there's dark parts. They get exposure to uh, real life forensic science experiences, real life forensic science uh, practices, and uh, a lot of them watch this stuff on TV and they and they think they know how it really works. And, and this is an opportunity for them to to experience this stuff for real, for how it's really done.